Um, first up, uh, Jan, uh, first up, congratulations to the short and thank you for your time uh, for this interview. I, I really want to talk to you when you know I got the opportunity, the opportunity to see it, you know, the, see the screener of it. And I, when I, the minute I, I, you know, I finished watching the short, I absolutely needed to talk to you because I was blown away with, with what you guys did. And, and I, obviously I don't want to enter into any, any spoilers, I don't want to enter into the details because I think it's really important for people to, you know, to, they, they're not going to expect what, what, what the short is all about. But obviously the, the title is something that will catch everybody, everybody's eye. How did that title come about? And, and obviously, I know I know the ending, so I know why the title. But I know a lot of people are gonna cut, you know, get, they got, the title's gonna, you know, it's gonna be something that you cut, they catch your eye. How did the title came about, and or was that something that that you saw from the beginning, or that's something that came about after everything was done? Um, well, yes, it is. Uh, thank you very much, also for for having me and and having this conversation uh, in the first place. That's that's very nice and, and very uh, good for you. Um, so. Um, the title, um, that was actually the first thing that was there. Um, in fact, uh, I was talking with the producer, with Ben, um, the moment I, uh, the evening before I went to the last time I was invited at South by Southwest, actually. So I was preparing to go to uh, Austin with another short, Homefield Bliss. And we were talking about stuff about uh, maybe doing another project together, and um, somehow this this title came about, um, and it was it was such a uh, it was such a fun thing. We we, we were actually joking around. Um, uh, imagine that this that there is a guy who has this like magic power. I mean, because he, he has this magic power, it's not completely realistic, I have to admit. Uh, but he has this tremendous power. Um, um, he can do amazing stuff, but um, it is by whispering uh, and um, on a specific part of the body. Uh, and so we were joking around and at the same time, immediately it struck to me, yes, but, um, and I'm not gonna say more because then I probably will spoil the story, but the whole dimension of the of, of, of the film was um, very soon very clear to me. Um, so it was actually a very easy uh, way of conceiving the story and and and, and of everything um, because it's so funny and so ridiculously in in, in a way. Um, but it's in the end you will see hopefully another dimension. Um, how, how, I mean, I, I, I mean, aside away from that question, I think, how did the, the, the short came about? I mean, I, I, again, I think anyone needs to stick around till the end. And, and mm -hmm. the, I think you said it best. It's really funny, but mm -hmm. it, it gets, you know, it's it, once I mean, all said and done, it's, it's just something else that you end up, you know, perceiving from it. So how mm -hmm. did the, the story came about? <laughs> how, how did you guys get, you know, got together and then, this, this is what we want to do. This is what we, the story that we want to tell. Um, I, I think uh, the most important thing was is, is the, um, the first was the, the, the character of, of uh, Maurice Sanders, of Magic Sandy. Um, I don't know, I, I, I didn't write. So we had this idea, I think in 2016. Then I went to, to Austin. And then I didn't write like for a few months. Because I thought, no, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna do this because it's, it's too complex with this, this strange title and the subject matter and, and stuff. But Ben keep, kept in, insisting. Actually, he said, you have to write this down. And so I, I it, it, it somehow uh, stayed inside of me, and it, it, it boiled up somehow. And then uh, we got this opportunity to take part of uh, on a um, at a, um, a, comp it's a kind of workshop, a European short pitch in which you can uh, develop story ideas for short words and you can pitch them also to, to producers. But in order to, to uh, take part of this, I, I needed a, a, a script. So I wrote a script in like one, I think, uh, session. Uh, and um, we were selected there. Uh, and then we met actually uh, a very important person for this uh, project, Emily Dubois. Uh, and she is a producer uh, from France, uh, based in Paris. And um, she was very interested in this project. 
Um, and uh, I already mentioned there, I can see only one person, one actor playing the role of Marie Sanders, and that's Denis Lavant. Um, and so she put me in contact with him. And that was a very, very important step. Uh, and then we um, yeah, uh, asked also for money at the, at the Flemish Film Fund, and, and we got it. Uh, it was without any Lavant mentioned. It, 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 we didn't have any actors mentioned there. It was just the concept of the film and the, and the script. We got that money, and then actually the, the, the ball went rolling. And then the, the difficult thing was when the knee was free uh, to do it. Um, and it, it, it took a, it took us some time to, to, to wait until he was free. But uh, I sent him the script. He was he re immediately uh, responded. He was very, very, very taken with it. And uh, we met him in Paris, uh, sit down uh, for some lunch. And, and, and we had a, a very, very nice talk. And it was, it was immediately uh, sold uh, to, to, to do the project. He, he really lo loved it. So it was great. I, I, I one other thing, one of many things that they did was the casting. I think the casting was really good. I think I think everyone, not just everyone, everyone did a great job with their performances. Okay. Because I, I, I mean, I, everyone's going to see the children. They're going to see that it's basically a, a team effort. I, I mean, regardless of who's famous or not, or who's an actor or not. So that's that's what I want to. I don't want to miss it that way. And I, 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 I'm going when I'm going with this comment is you know. Walk us through it because it's clearly fun. It's, it has a message. It has, you know, it's it's, it's fun with a with an important message. But um, walk us through a day in set, understanding where it's all going and where the fun part is, and then you know, uh, walk us through a typical day of set and how how did that how did it come about? How did people react to what was going on and where their story was going? Well. Um... It, it, we, we only shot for uh, we, we shot four days, so we, we were quite busy. Um, we didn't rehearse, so because um, uh, Denis came from Paris uh, and uh, Wendy from Leeds, uh, and we didn't have much money, so um, we didn't have any time besides the shooting days to really work with the actors. So I got some time on set to to rehearse a bit but it was not so much time so we we were all very focused and um there was some joking around and there was uh, i think that the atmosphere was 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 okay but at the same time there was also this tension because we we, we shouldn't um, run late and and we shouldn't uh, make too much extra extra uh, shooting hours which we did one 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 day actually. Uh, I think a very important scene, uh, the the scene where uh, Maurice and 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 uh, the young model they they, they are together. Mm -hmm. It took it took some time, but it was it was worth it, I think. Um, but I I was very uh, much also uh, I was very happy that the uh, the actors were really um, super focused, and and that also people with hardly any experience like Wendy in, as an actor. Um, she completely uh, was, was uh, fitted in in, in in the movie. It, 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 I mean, it was a, it was a marvelous set. Um, so I, I don't think there was so much stress, but at the same time, it was very serious also. I mean, uh, yeah, it's, uh, filming is a serious business sometimes. So. <laughs> yeah. um, two final questions. And I'm glad you mentioned Wendy because uh, again, I think, um, I, when I when I first got the the media kit, the the first thing that I the, the first person that I see is Wendy and her introduction to the to the short, mm -hmm. and obviously once I see it, I understand everything, and I understand her introduction. I understand what you did with the mm -hmm. story. What was her reaction when you know would you approach her for the project, and was you know how was she surprised? Was she resistant? How was she? she how did you yeah. react? You reacted to everything. She was completely surprised. Um, afterwards, she told her, as uh, she told us, that she told her husband that she, for a moment, she thought it was a scam um, because she's not an actor. Um, but someone uh, from from a, a production company, she she um, she found her, and and um, because we we we, it took us a long time to find the perfect person and I think Wendy is this perfect person mm 
Mm -hmm. uh, she has the the charisma and the energy, and she is a she is a, so such a positive person and such an, a person full of energy. And she once then we 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 met on Skype, uh, and we 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 talked. I explained the story, um, and she was very much also immediately part of it. Uh, it, it took no no. Uh, effort at all to convince her uh, she, she was because I also explained a bit um, the dimension of the movie uh, where we come from and, and how we're gonna end she, she read the script of course and um, she completely agreed and she thought it was a very important message also mm -hmm. uh, and she wanted really very much also to, to be part of this um, but it was so great to have her on set because um, I mean, the fact that she was part of, or is part of this, is for me also a very, uh, actually the main reason to, 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 to make this movie. I mean, um, I, I know we're talking very mysterious now, mysteriously now, but um, yes, people should watch the film first and then, um, yeah. Yeah. One final question before I let you go. Um, when, I, I know people now love this short and I know, People are going to watch it because of the title and they're going to be surprised at what they end up seeing. What do you want people to take away from the story once they see it? Oh, that's a difficult question. Um, I want it to be an, an, an interesting, surprising, maybe also a bit of puzzling film. I like the fact that people are, because a lot of films are made in a way that you know already uh, before you start watching the film, what you are gonna ex get. Mm -hmm. uh, and I like the fact that people are taken off guard a bit. Um, for me, this is a film about love. This is a love story mm -hmm. um, uh, with, with a lot of, or maybe not a lot, but with humor. So I hope mm -hmm. there will be the irony of the whole thing mm -hmm. and the humor of the whole thing will be clear. Um, but for me, this is basically a love story about two people um, who didn't see each other for years and um, who meet each other again. About a woman who, who reaches out and she wants to meet the, the guy again. She, yeah, he, who perhaps got away, but maybe he's not got away uh, in the end. Yeah. Jan, I want to congratulate you again for the short. I really, Thank you very really much. Caught, it really caught me by surprise. I really wasn't expecting to see what I saw when mm -hmm. I finally saw the, the, the short. And that's why I need to talk to you. Honestly, I, I really, I really, 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 I really, this, is, this interview is gonna come out uh, before the, the festival starts. This, uh, but I want people to, to you know, keep an eye on this short. And, and, and if you have the opportunity yeah. to see it, go see it. You're gonna, people are gonna enjoy it. I know they're gonna love it. And, and, and it's, gonna, it's gonna spark a conversation. I know it's gonna, Spark a conversation, and, and I, and I, that would and be I, nice. That would be nice. And I have to congratulate you on it, and, and 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 again, thank you for your time, for the space, for the interview. That's really, that's that to me. That means a lot, mostly because of your story. Thank you for your time. Okay, thank you for having uh, me on this on in our project on on your program. Thank you very much. Thank you. And for your